For me, the answer is simple. I find that these companies always getting bought out because I feel like white corporates want to be able to control the narrative. So whether it's in health and beauty, skincare, they want to control the narrative. If you notice, especially within the health and skincare industry and stuff like that, yeah, when it comes to black health, they are hardcore on trying to buy those businesses out. And if you notice that when those companies are bought out, the ingredients always change. Why is the ingredients always changing? Why is it not the same that it was that helps our skin and all of a sudden you use a certain body washes and your body feels itchy and that? Why is it that anything to do with music as well um, and entertainment, the white corporates buy it out from us? Because again, they want to control the narrative. Why do you think you don't hear much positive black music around like in the old days? Like, why is it all about killing each other and competing with each other and people hating each other? Programming our minds to think that this is get, um, towards each other. Why is it that even within other industries, when black businesses come in, they buy it out? For me, I think it's to control the narrative. Control the narrative, what we see, hear, taste, breathe, absorb, download in our minds, man. To control the narrative, to keep us imprisoned. We need to break free. If you're a black business owner... Do me a favour and don't sell your business when it comes to successful. Try and scale it up to another level or be like Jay-Z and just sell a part of it and make sure you still got some ownership. Yeah, 